Another type of function you are going to need to be able to take the derivative of are logarithmic functions. So logarithmic functions can have many bases, as you know, or they might be the natural log, which is ln. Just like with your exponential functions, the easier derivative was with e to the x, because that was always itself. Similarly with logarithmic functions, the natural log is going to be the simpler one. The derivative of ln x is going to be 1 over x. Now, what happens if you have a log with a base other than the natural number e? Let's say we had, for example, log of any base a of x, and we wanted to take that derivative. Well, what we would need to do is we're still going to have 1 over x, like you might expect, but you're, need, you're going to need to multiply by ln of a in the bottom. You can see that if you have ln, which is log base e, ln of e is 1, this goes away and just becomes the 1 over x. So for a quick example, if we wanted to do log base 2 of x and take that derivative, we would just need, uh, it would be 1 over x times ln 2. So differentiating log functions is pretty similar to differentiating your exponential functions. You have this factor of ln a. Just with log functions, it's on the bottom of the fraction, whereas with your exponential functions, it was multiplied.